just gonna leave it on, okay? Okay. Welcome back to another video. If you are new here, hi, my name is Naomi and this is Real Naomi B. If you're not, good morning, everybody. And a special good morning to the good body gal and the good body gal only. Welcome back to another video. Welcome back to another vlog. Don't really have time to chat. So we're just gonna do a quick moisturizer on the face. Blush. Gloss. Love that for me! The top that I'm gonna go with is gonna be this creamy ivory sweater. Okay, let's put on a belt. Yeah, I automatically like that so much better. And quickly pop on some jewelry. I'm gonna snap on my tennis bracelet as well. JBW on the wrist. This is gonna be the only jewelry that I wear today. This is made with Guyanese gold. It was given to me by my wife. Tennis bracelet, love bracelet dupe. JBW watch, you know my gold chain. And then I'm gonna pop in these super cute little 14 karat dangly earrings. And I love, oh, so cute. Like, how cute is that? I put the mascara on the lashes. It just looks put together, but natural, like, as natural as you can possibly get. Brushed and lightly filled in my brows, mascara, a bit of blush, lip gloss, and of course my face is nicely moisturized so you can see all the glowy high points of my face. Love that, love that, love that. I think I already know which shoes I'm leaning for. Brown loafers with the pearl. I decided to go for my Brandon Blackwood trunk i've been looking at this scarf all morning and i want to wear it and in this scarf it has all that pretty colors i was gonna go for my pillow tabby and wear the pillow tabby because that's the nice mustard that mustardy yellow color off my pillow tabby over there so i'm like you know what i haven't worn um my brandon blackwood bag all season i feel like i didn't wear it this fall and I'm gonna find a way to incorporate it in this winter's outfit. I love this outfit. Oh my goodness. I just re. <laughs> with the bag. I love it. I love it. I love it. I know it may not be other people's cup of tea but who cares it's mine so for fragrance i am gonna go with my essences from egypt i'm gonna go with the one called i believe it's called anubis if not anubis it's isis this smells so good it smells better than baccarat because this is the essence that you find in baccarat without the alcohol and any other additives that they use to stretch the product to then mass produce it to you i'm just fortunate that we were able not only go to egypt but also afford to buy these luxury essences and i'm cherishing them I, i'm cherishing them for real i smell so good like and i'm not saying this because it's me i just it just smells so good it, Okay guys, let's go. An iced latte needs to be stirred up and I'm having an iced coffee, no creamer, no sugar, black. I did not bring any sunglasses, that's not like me. Say so guys, I'm fine. 
finally set up in the room. Come in. Yeah, my wife is literally parking outside. Can we wait on her? In the procedure room? There's nobody else? Aw. Right. Right, wait, hold on. Can I call you back in two minutes? I'm gonna put this here, I'm just gonna leave it on, okay? Okay. How do you feel? Uncomfortable? Yeah. Yeah. How was it? It wasn't bad, I just... I'm always a little nervous when it comes to the doctors. Yeah, but you did good. No, I like, kept. Oh no, I kept saying something. No, because like then that. you kept. You looked defeated when you looked like you were about to pass out. Like you were giving birth. I don't know, I just. Sorry, baby. Tired of shit being wrong with me, you know? Yeah. Honestly, like. The car is across the street. Let's go. Okay, you guys, we made it to our, oh, God, we made it to our favorite grocery store. We're about to go and do some shopping at Trader Joe's. We do have a little dinner, I want to say a dinner party, but we do have a little, we have guests coming over tonight. My brother-in-law and my, my brother and my sister-in-law. They live pretty much, they live pretty close, like within five minutes of us. We're a couple, we're a couple, so we have monthly couples night at our house. And eventually, once they fully settle into their house, we'll, you know, we'll go back and forth. So they're coming over tonight, and tonight, the theme is, the last time we had taco night, tonight's theme is breakfast for dinner. So, I'm excited. I think we're having like, um chicken and waffles and some other breakfast stuff like cheesy eggs or something of the sort so I'm definitely excited let me get settled Have you decided what you want your treat to be as yet? Right, let's see what she's gonna pick as her treat. I got the, for my treat, I got chili spiced mangoes. Love, love, love. How do you keep the plant alive? Because when I take it home, this is my third time buying it, it dies in like two days when I take it home. I ain't even How do you guys lie. keep it alive? Uh, some people, what's the word, propagate it? Like you could take it off, like little pieces off, put it in water. And make it grow more. Plant. Uh, yeah. I'll try. Okay. <laughs> guys, we are out of here with the third time the charm. We're going to try and grow this. <laughs> Thank you. That was fun. Yeah, I felt like we went in with an intention, getting exactly what we needed, and we did without over shopping. I feel like because we shop a little bit more in smaller portions for exactly the amount of time that we need the food for, we've been able to stay on budget as well as still get some fun things to try. You took out your. your Oh, you didn't take out my mangoes. I didn't know you wanted right now. Okay, it's okay. 
as a treat because today's Friday and we did good all week consistently really we really really did and I love that even when we ate out we ensured that we shared an entree to stay in our calorie deficit and then also shared a salad having something green every day for the past seven days and uh, Good job, baby. And minimal sugar. So, a min I have been doing zero sugar. She's been doing minimal sugar. The only sugar she actually has is a little bit in her morning coffee, and that's just what's in the in the creamer that she uses. Ever so often, like on a day like this, when we do our Trader Joe's run, we like to get something each, one piece each, as a treat. She decides to go for the fig and olive crisps. Uh, a crispy, savory, and sweet cracker to complement cheeses, spreads, dips, and toppings. Let's try it. Mm. Smells good, right? Mm. Mm -hmm. I like the crunch. I love that. I am not a big fan of raisins, but there is some dry. Oh, it's fig. Oh, it's fig. That's the reason why I like it. Because. Look at that. Okay, you guys, we are back home, and I figured I would give you a quick little Trader Joe's haul because you know we love that over here. I feel like that's you guys love to watch and see what I pick up from the grocery store, especially from Trader Joe's. So we're gonna go through real quickly. So we decided to go for the potted herb garden. This is the organic basil. Instead of getting takeout or, or something that we can count either the calories or the sodium, we like to buy things that we can count and we can count on Trader Joe's to give us precise measurements on, on what I would deem as like a cheap meal or a snack. So we decided to go for this flatbread, the burrata prosciutto and arugula flatbread. And then we also got the anacopita Perfectly flaky phyllo dough with a comfort filling of spinach, feta, and ricotta cheese. Then you would have heard us talk about these fig and olive crisps. We tasted it in the car. Then, because we are hosting breakfast for dinner, we have a few options in there that we will be using in the menu for tonight. For appetizers, we decided to go with some quiche, mini quiche duo. A duo of Swiss cheese and mushrooms and uncured bacon. Looks like that. Regular degula pancake mix with some orange juice for mimosas. Pepper Jack Monterey Jack cheese with jalapeno peppers. Shredded Parmesan cheese. Spiced chili mangoes. Trader Joe organic dressing. It's Italian with Romano cheese. A Thai sweet ginger sauce. And the next sauce is the sweet chili sauce. Sweet and delight whipped cream kombucha. This is the Pink Lady Apple flavor. I'm going to quickly pack these groceries away and go do some work. I have to finish editing a video, so I'm gonna go work on that. I'll pick you guys back up later, so see you in a bit. Oh my God, you guys, I just finished posting day 15 vlog. Today is day 15, like, I can't believe I, you know what? things happen life happened 37 more minutes before it is up and we got it done however it is time for our guests our guests should be arriving shortly but I just want to show you the fantastic work that my wife did outside it's so important that when you get into a relationship to find a partner that supports and love you and really is kind to your passions and is actually interested and support your passions and your craft. I wouldn't have been able to be as successful as I am so far without my wife and that's just on period. She knows exactly how I like the aesthetics and the vibes to be and of course she delivered. So let me show you what's going on.
for another. Mm-hmm. Bussin. Fries with Parmesan. It's so good. I've been trying not to go through it, you know? No, my sister said she had one to give us. You like the sauce for the fries? Yeah. Gotta be a brother. So you stay asking me questions and I tell you no. Let's go. Woo! Plates, to okay, they're leaving. I'm so happy to have you guys over. I like this shirt. <laughs> so happy that you guys came. We had a really good time. Thank you guys for having us. See you guys next time. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really do hope that you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> Turn on your post notification so you do not miss the right post another video. And until next time, love, love you, bye! bye. <laughs>